I don't know. How do you make how do you make sphere bird? Uh, it's really difficult. I did it in Minecraft once, and I basically had like this series of about thirty images, and it was like, okay, here's one layer of sphere. Here's another layer okay. of sphere. There's another layer. Because right now I want to make sphere. <laughs> okay. Um. It's like different too, like what, like there's like a specific pattern that you're supposed to do it in. Like there's an algorithmic way to do it. I just don't really know what it is because it's very complicated based on whether you're making like an even radius versus an odd radius and a whole bunch of variables like that that nobody cares about. Let's fire up OC Remix. Okay. This is also hard because I'm making it out of glass blocks. Yeah, I don't I know if that's would a, be a pain in the in, in the ass net. I don't know if this is a good idea. You're gonna have to come here and uh. Once you get in, you'll kind of see what I'm going for and why I'm doing this. Okay, why this has become so. important to me. Okay, if you say so. You don't have to be so condescending about it. I'm just saying, like, I, I'm not that impressed by spheres in my day-to-day -day interactions with anything sphere-related. I mean... You know, I think that spheres are very overrated. So you're more of like a... Dodecahedron ah. kind of person, or like... This is a pretty solid attempt at a sphere. Yeah, that's why I want to make one. Yeah. Oh, you're saying... Oh, this is downloaded. I was gonna say, like, it seems like you nailed it. Like, yeah. Not, like, this looks so like that... the MS Paint style, like, sphere. So that's... Or not sphere, but like, circle tool and stuff like that. Y that's very obviously somebody else's, I would say. Um, yeah. <laughs> so the reason... The reason why I... I want a sphere, is uh -huh. I want it to be smaller than this, because this one's too big. Probably. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the I way that it works, uh, is it's like a, it's like a recursive thing, right? So you have, like, okay, here's a sphere of base size one, you know, and then Whoopee. if you want to make it, like, bigger than that, you basically just, like, build the sphere up from, uh, a bunch of layers of circles, if that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. So to like let's make a I'm gonna make a slightly bigger sphere now. And like this is what I did was I have a sphere where the top layer is a size one and the bottom layer is a size one and then the middle layer is a size two. Does that make sense? Yeah. So you just keep like building it up like that and you just have to have like all the patterns memorized. I think that's how you could do a sphere. But they have like a slightly different approach to it. I don't know. Remember how we made the mega sphere and it was okay? Yeah. I think mm -hmm. I figured out how to make the mega sphere. Yeah. You just and like take this, this is thing and this is it. close. <laughs> N well, that's you know what I, I'm gonna do What's that. It? You cannot. That's probably better than recreating this this sphere. I feel oh, yeah, I feel it's, it's such a pain in the ass. Like making spheres takes so much work. It's very very difficult. I just I just I just don't need one this large. That's the problem. I need like oh. maybe seventy five percent of this. And that's the oh, issue you, I'm working you, with. You want a bubble boy sphere. You don't want like a, you don't want like a survival in the. In Actually, like the, yeah. Sphere. You know, I could go back and get our sphere. Come to think of it, um, ours might be a little bit small though. So, uh, hop into that one and try driving it around. It's actually pretty self-explanatory. I guess I'm gonna find out. Let's crank this, like lift up. Never mind. All right, let's uh, get on the lift. The oily, greasy-ass lift for whatever reason. I hate that. How you, like, slide off the top and stuff? Ah, it's so damn annoying. Okay, I'm gonna get closer, so at least if I slip off, I have a chance of landing on the side of it. I'm going from... Son of a... It's like... Uh, if you're having trouble, put a chair like, on top of it. Sides. Well, it, it's not that they slanted the sides. It's just the, it's that your character can't handle the collision going up. Oh, that... that I buy that. Yeah. I gotta say... They made the inside of this thing look really nice. I know. Um. Uh oh. You're probably going <laughs> to close that door, by the way. So. Uh, uh. Okay, so two closes the door. One makes you go forward. Three turns you left. Four turns you right, or the reverse. I don't exactly remember. Um. Yeah. It looks like but, that's how well it goes. Yeah. It. In my mind, it almost might make sense if W made you go forward. A and D made you spin suspension glitch style. Uh-huh. I 
Uh, I see what you're saying. I see why you want to hack this thing up. You want to throw some, some suspension glitches on it, make it easier to steer. Yeah, because, I mean, realistically, I'm not even sure if I need all the levels of gyroscope here. Uh, they definitely make it a lot harder to steer than... Yeah, because be, I think I'd only need one level of gyroscope. Yeah, maybe. Okay, you know what? I'm going to start chopping this thing up. Whomever made this, thank you. I think that this idea you. is remarkably way too complicated. But, uh, I'll... Well, I'll, it makes sense I'll from the perspective of somebody that's never done... Uh... I mean, I think it's just too complicated for us to do. <laughs> We want to see what it looks like from the inside again. And it looks awfully sweet, if I may say so. It's got a real nice vibe to it. Okay, there we go. Uh, the problem I have with this build is that it's impossible to leave. Yes. It's kind of a giant pain in the butt. Okay. Yeah. I think that ultimately I'm impressed by the fact that they made a sphere. Which they probably just have one, like, in the workshop. And yeah. they also, like, have a gyroscope. Like, those are two cool things. But I don't think that they combine to make a functional vehicle at the end of the day. You know, here's a question, Bird. Huh? I could, uh, I could line the intri uh, the inside of this thing with, uh, wood blocks. Uh-huh. I don't know. To what end? Like, I just don't want a sphere this big. Well, That's... do you want to... I can... I mean... People making spheres in, like, voxel games since Minecraft, so... I mean, there's yeah. tons of, like, cheat sheets you can just use for reference. The problem is... I just is don't want to spend all the time... long time. I don't want to spend all the small... time doing yeah. this. I, I I guess I'm I'm forced to make do with what I got. Yeah, even a small sphere takes, like, a, probably a good 20 minutes to get right. Yeah. If you, it, with, if you know what you're doing. This thing probably took this person like 45 minutes, hour and a half, something in that range. Yeah, I don't think and, we got uh, time for that. I have no idea when Keith is yeah. showing up, but I don't think any either of us have the interest in that sort of thing. Okay. Not at all. So I guess I'll oh. start building. Uh, are you trying to knock me over? No, maybe. I don't think it's going to work, Barty, Barty Mord. <laughs> ah, man can dream. I mean, he can. Doesn't mean it's a good dream. Nah, it's not. Uh, can you can you put this on a lift, by the way? Sure. I mean, do you want to be in a chair, or do you want me to lift you? Uh, yeah, I'll be in a chair. That'll make it. Okay. E uh, they'll make it easier. Okay, there we go. Because I need a I need to weld some things together here, and uh -huh. that's gonna be kind of hard. Right. Okay, makes sense. So, Bird, well, uh, how, about, uh, yeah. how about for today's uh, today's episode, session, whatever, seeing as we're waiting mm -hmm. on Keith, let's just cannibalize other people's workshop things and try and improve them, or make them more interesting in some way, shape, or form. Okay, I'll pick something interesting and and see if I can... Uh, oh, no, I, Google, I forgot. Googles it up. Probably shouldn't have had you put this on a lift to begin with. I should have gotten it. Getting in and out of this thing is going to be a nightmare. Uh, here, here, here. Watch. No, 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 I got it. I got it. I'm actually gonna go through and delete all the other shit, too. Because there's a ton of stuff in the way here. Okay, go for it. Let's see. This is a really inefficient build. What is? I'm just looking at his, like, weird gyroscope thing. I'm not actually sure if it's any more or less, uh, efficient than what I'm gonna try and do. We'll see. What the hell is this? Wander? Yeah? I found something that I don't know, uh... Make it. Let's see, let's uh, see what, let's see what you're you confused for it? It Sure. Probably takes, it's gonna take a lot of room. Okay, let me get the ball out of here. Uh, what? It's uh, a Flappy Bird simulator. <laughs> Are you guys just testing out other people's creations right now? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just really confused about... Oh. <laughs> this is... What? My oh, God. Geez. 
Oh, um, um. It, I think the thing's supposed to be animated. Yeah, here. I'm going for it. I'm, I'm playing Flabby Bird and Scrap Mechanic right now. What are you what trying to do, do to it? I don't know. It, I, you turned off my forward thrust. That's what you did. Oh, God. So, Why did it suddenly get a lot faster? Supposedly, it's supposed to do things. No bearings connected. What the devil? I'm kind of very curious to see how they managed to get, like, this really cool, like, central pivot thing going on. Where you can, like, oh. go both up and down with it. Oh, the reason why and, you're like, faster around. is because I turned on the electrical engine. Yeah. That's what that does. Yeah, originally that didn't yep. have one. So you go yeah. really fast. This is... That's kind of neat. Yeah, this is really strange. I'm sure it looks awesome from, from your perspective. Here, do you want to give it a go? You want to get in? You want to give it a go? Uh, sure. Alright, because I your... want to see what it looks like from an outsider so that I can, you know, get some get some okay. footage. How do how do I how do I go? What, uh, you what press are... one. There you are. And then you just gotta go up and down and oh. try to like go between the pipes. Wow. It really is just flappy birds. I yeah. see, so the the engine's supposed to make you go forward automatically. Yeah, but, but it doesn't it's, really Well, it's work also so limited stuck that, on the thing. Yeah. yeah. People are you saying know, I got a score of zero. Just because I hit every single pipe. <laughs> I bet we could actually make this, like, but bigger and actually functional. You mean just like a regular, like, flying obstacle course? Yeah, we probably could make that. Unless you really meant, like, a central pivot spire thing like this. Well, it would be central pivot spire <laughs> thing, but, like, huge. Yeah. And, oh god, but it would have to be on a controller. See, the problem, though, is that, like, the size of the thing is going to grow exponentially compared to the, um, like, the, 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 param the perimeter. So we'd have to make an, in like, we'd have to make a really gigantic circle. Um, and it wouldn't actually be that much longer than this one. Comparatively, I, you know what I mean? Well, the other alternative is we could make, like, a thing that almost goes back and forth. See how my dwarfs, like, kind of going this way? And then back, uh -huh. like, and it would just have like two pipes that automatically randomly adjust size. Let's do that when we can yeah. actually program shit. I also don't like Flappy Birds, so there's also that. <laughs> yeah, it was just marvelous to look at. Like, bravo, whoever made this thing. It's very strange that you did, but it sure is interesting to play with it. Some people just have their things. Yeah, I guess so. But no, the uh, the area of a circle grows a lot faster than the perimeter, so. It would it would be a pain in the ass to like oops what did this build? Oh I tried to build my maze. Oh god, okay, we're not building my maze. <laughs> Our mazes are glorious. But also not But also no. Yeah. What the hell is this? Okay. Plain Servigni. Hola! I make plain Servigni. Did you find uh, Pennsylvania in there? No, I, it's Pennsylvania, obviously. That the mean. hell? It's humongous. I'm curious and concerned. All right, I'll try to build Pennsylvania again, but I, I, it's like so hard to find a place to put it because it's so massive. Wait, there we are. All right, there's plain. Jesus, this thing is enormous. Um, <laughs> can you fly it? I don't know. The description of the Steam Workshop said very light and small, and neither of those appear to be true. I All mean, right, I'm gonna put the, by the Russian down standards, plain Cerveni. Who knows? Oh, it could actually. Oh, good lord! Yeah. There is are just... nine. Um. Oh, glorious. Switches to use. I what the love hell was those. That? Did I just put the landing gear down? You might have. Uh oh, this is taking off. And... Bye, bird. Goodbye, bird. <laughs> Goodbye, bird. Oh, no, I believe in you. Of any. I believe in you. You can do it. Like no I'm just one ever turn man all the could. On. Okay. 
Goodbye, yeah, birds. Yeah, planes of any. <laughs> it was good plane. I have the twas, best planes. Twas good plan. <laughs> did was did very fly very plane. Did did the fly very good? Did the die very good? Oh. Oh. Plane, poor plane of any. Let's kill plane of any now. <laughs> uh, all right, let's check out another weirdity of the workshop. I wonder if the guy is specifically focused on having this thing perfectly balanced. Does it make sense? Uh, oh, hi. Okay, there we go. Uh, no, that's fine actually. This is going to take a while. That is. Do a sad. barrel roll if you get up high. Uh, well, spoiler alert. I didn't, and I won't. Oh, you know what? I could weld this on. That'd suck. <laughs> uh, I guess I could make it upside down. That'd suck, too. Funny, th Finding other fun things? I found this. Is it plain surf- What? It's- Uh, mind well, rotating go, it I'm so I can see it? Button. Okay. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, what? it's it's a oh functional walker. <laughs> well, oh, and it's down. Oh no! <laughs> Wait, iPhone. is it a walking iPhone? Is that the point it's of this? It's a walking iPhone. <laughs> 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 wow, and that looks damn, slick. It doesn't look slick as hell. Like, but that. <laughs> <laughs> it's also drunk it's really as drunk. <laughs> it doesn't really walk. It just dies. Well, you know what? It works. Phone. It works better than any of our walking machines. Nah, dude, my walking machine was legit. Your walking this... machine was a piece of shit. It was an you... amazing this piece my... of shit. No, what are you talking about? My chicken walker was awesome. All I know I just don't even is... remember it. Is that its walk cycle? Made me regret being human. Or having <laughs> legs. My my thing's walk cycle was... I mean, it wasn't, you know, inspirational. It was a little bit quappy. But, I mean, that's fine, isn't it? This thing's, uh, like, front plate is totally loaded with Neumotrons. And I'm a little bit sad that none of them are hooked up. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah. It, it feels like it should, it, it should have some kind of... Sensor somehow that freaks yeah. out the moment it like falls moment over. It it's like, <laughs> it's just, it's ah! like ah! uh, let's see if Cerveni made any other things. Ah, he made dildo rocket and UFO Cerveni. I'm not gonna download either of those. Ah. Uh. The, I mean, this guy really likes his Cervenis. Mm hmm You know, I just realized the problem with this is... And the what? reason why that guy has that, like, um... Inner gyroscope situation? You know what? It might just be better if I show it off, like, in a couple of seconds. Okay, let me know when to, when I should be looking at you. Okay, I'm, I'm not even gonna... the workshop for nonsense. I'm not even gonna put suspension glitches in here yet. Because this is... A, I love this remix every time it comes on. It's so good. This remix is good. It also, it's a very classic one. It's well, kind of like a, how whenever that, that, that Shinobi remix comes on, I'm always like, yeah, I'm cool with it. Well, this is just straight up... Uh, if I remember right, this is just straight up uh, Solar Fields Mirror's Edge. Mm. Am I wrong? Nope, I'm not. Yeah, this is just straight for the soundtrack. Oh. Which is kind of... the Kind of weird. I actually, I mean, I've heard it before, but I've never like looked into it. Oh yeah, I remember. I hear the whistling thing now. Yeah, that's just, yeah, that's the Mirror's Edge. <laughs> I should probably play the uh, uh, most recent one. Oh, uh, oh mother, fuck! Honor, I bought an yeah. RV. We're gonna go across the country and, right. and and see the see the world. Whoops. Let me... Let me see if I can get my ball a rolling. Okay, there we go. Oh, 
crap. I'm gonna need an odd seat for this. That's annoying. Does it work? The hell? What? What? This RV can poop a smaller RV. <laughs> what? Look, I'm gonna poop a smaller RV. <laughs> Why? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh baby, this RV is going places. That almost hurt my ears, and I'm wearing noise canceling headphones. Uh, Why? Look at. It's a poop, it's an RV it's that like poops this RV RVs. It's like came out of Alien. Hey, Bird, can you quickly pop out of that? Oh, wow. It's an extending <laughs> RV. You want it's me to not get an out? extending why? RV. Can you, uh, can you delete my lift? I want to yeah, show you sure. why this thing is a problem. There it goes. So this is why this guy has thing things. I Oh, because this platform is unbalanced. Well, it's not and even it's the not like exerting the pressure correctly. It's it's the way the thrusters are hooked up. Oh, this is a pain in the ass. I'm gonna have to throw everything away. Probably start over. Maybe I'll just lift the guy's dumb thing. Or I think I'll give up and try this again on another day when I feel more yeah, motivated. I'm feeling too stupid because I know I, I know Coop's gonna be coming, so I just kind of wanna. Oh yeah. Uh, what? Was... Also, then I what? Reading okay. Stuff, but okay. Bird, I want you to take a look at this car. This is like the most sensually driving car I have ever seen. That thing's pretty cool looking. Yeah, this is uh, this is actually a stock car that I the uh, developers like made. Oh uh, yeah, that makes sense. I had made a couple of cars like that back in the day. Oh yeah, it's like the best turning ever, which is why the developers ma uh, made it like beyond making like a cool ass game. They're also apparently very good at engineering, Go which figure. is really yeah. No, it's... the people who made that. this thing are absolutely incredible. If I may say what? so, this is such a good build. Wait, ha hi, who it? Hang on, I'm, you wanna? I'm... Oh my god, bird. What? I don't want to look at the controllers. I'm sure they're awesome. I don't know what this one's doing. Oh, it's uh, like a sensor system. What's it? What? How you doing? I I don't know. There's like bird. I want you uh, to. Oh fuck! Oh, I just deleted a random I block. I pulled out the connector tool. Bird, I'm sorry. I deleted a random block, and I'm not sure what it did. I think it's That's okay. It's fine. Though. Pull out the connector tool and just look. I know. I know. I saw. Holy hell. Fuck. Yeah. Wow. We have been absolutely outdone. Absolutely. Okay, so that's <laughs> the horn. That unpoops the, uh... <laughs> the RV. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what that does. Oh. What did that do? Oh, that does that. That's the door. Damn! Wow. This thing is maneuverable. Okay. This stock car is legit. So, does it actually poop out an extra part of the RV, or does it just extendo the RV? It, it just extendos it. It's really, it's not like a separate RV comes out like, ah, uh, hi, or anything like that. It's just like, it's there. Oh wow, there's like a whole bedroom back here. I know. I didn't even bother to explore the interior because I was so impressed with the fact that it transforms in every possible way. I mean, to be this... fair, the the extendo bit is kind of... It's more of kind of a fun gimmick than anything. There's not actually a whole lot with that. I just want yeah, to know how it works. Yeah, but doing the roof thing is, incre is incredible. I also really wish you could label switches because getting out of this is a pain in the ass. These stairs yeah. are slick and okay. I bird. Yeah. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put this thing on the ground. Okay. I'm gonna put it on a lift. We are going okay. to uh, dissect it, dissect its secrets. 
All right. Uh, well, you, you deleted a block. I, that, I think I fixed we, it. Did you put it back? I think I fixed it. Okay, that's all. That's all we need to know. So, um. Okay, you wanna climb uh, aboard somehow? Uh, yeah, I guess I can. Wow, this is putting it up on stocks like that feels like an actual dissection. You creep. Look, it's necessary. Damn it! How the f fuck? How does this extend, bird? I don't know. Um, I have to get, I'm gonna get in, and we're gonna find out. Damn it! Bird, do you want me to teach you a secret? Oh, you figured it out. Yeah. All right. Uh, Press so the I'm extendo extend button. Uh, oh, what? you broke wow. it! Wow. That's really simple. Oh, wait, no you didn't. Um, it might not... Okay, now it's broken. It's not yeah, coming now back. We, now we've shattered this thing. Bird, just hop out. I All can't right. believe... It's... What? That's how it Whoa. extended. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, I know. We need to do something with this mechanic. Because it was All that it is simple. Is pushing. It's a piston. It yeah. It's a piston. That's all it is. We yeah. We finally figured, learned how to make a piston. I mean, it's like a Mondo piston. It still works. Fascinating. Well, we learned, we, we've learned a secret. I wonder what will happen if I killed the piston. Like, if I just broke a brick off of it. Go for it. Well. <laughs> that was a that. A lot of lag. Yeah, well, it just disconnected, like, a ton of things from, uh... Yeah, oh, man, the lag is... very real. <laughs> yeah. What happened? I cut it oh, apart. Oh, the whole back end is disconnected. Yeah. Like... This is what happens when you disconnect the, uh, piston. Huh. Yeah. Neat. What else is there before- before Keith gets his act together? Well, there's- there's definitely the crazy thing where, uh, like, the whole top, like, opens up and stuff like that. Did you see that? Uh, I can turn that on real quick. Yeah, I saw that. That was cool. What the hell is this thing? Oof. Sorry for the okay. lag. Oh my god. This thing puts my tank to shame. <laughs> All of them. Oh, wow. That tank is cool. How the fudge biscuits do you get in here? Oh. Oh, wow, this is slick as shit. The lag is getting pretty real. Oh, it's, man, that's some yeah, lag. It's, it's, it's so real. Oh, man, bird. You need to get in here. I'm coming over to say hi to this tank. This is wild looking. No! Oh, uh, get in. Okay. Why? What what the hell what the what the what the what what I just want you to take a look at how this what? Oh. Um What? Why what? What? Why are you like ejecting what? me from the tank? Why what? am I underneath the tank right now? Why is there a seat down there? I don't know, but don't go forward. You're dragging my head through the through the ground. Okay, right. you have been fixed. Right. I mean, I'm gonna get out, and then come over here, and I'm gonna press that button. Oh, uh, that they're... was apparently the go button. This thing there's looks a... very. By the way, there's a gunnery seat that you can reach. Oh, okay. Somehow. Okay. Uh, here, I'll take the gunnery seat, you pilot. You want me to pilot? Okay. Yeah. Oh, only two switches, that's nice. Okay, hold on. It I gotta looks... figure out how to get to the gunnery seat. Unless the gunnery seat is that one down there. No, it doesn't look like it. How it looks like there's some pistons at the top you could look into. 
Bird, can you help me? Can Pretty you see out. if there are any? Look. Oh, oh, got you, it. You got it. There you are. Good job. That looks well, that's... pretty cool, actually. All right, can you uh, can you turn the turret? Uh, oh, yeah. that's the that the cannon firing thing is the annoying electrons. That's cute. I was kind of hoping I could like tilt it up and down. This is yeah. slick and completely non-functional. Want to joyride for a bit? Sure. Did I close the the butt of the tank? I can't really tell. Yeah, yeah, butt of the tank has been. Oh, okay, that's good. another gunnery seat in the back. Yeah, there's like a there's like a machine gun or something back there. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. This tank turns pretty right, you damn wanna, well. You wanna? No. Uh, What's up? Did I? Did you get ejected? You did. I, I hopped see. out. I want. I wanted to see how the gunnery uh, seat in the back works. Oh, okay, I stopped. Because I didn't even realize that was a functional thing. I've stopped though. There's also like regular like uh, engines hooked up to this thing, so it can just go forward and backwards without the uh, thrusters. Ah! <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, here I'll get the. Do I to press one? Seat. I got it. I got it. All right. I'm not you actually sure if this gunnery seat has any functionality. I don't think it does. It doesn't I gotta look say, like they made these barrels at the end of the guns look really great, though. Oh, absolutely. I mean, everything looks awesome on this thing. Like I said, puts me to shame. Okay. Well, I don't I know where you're creeping right behind me. I, uh, look. Why are you oh, dude. Pull it. Uh, hop out. Hop out. Pull out your connector tool. Whoop. I'm on the outside of the tank. Uh, I'm back on the inside of the tank. Tank is now joyriding without us. Do you see What's yourself all this, like, through the? Up to? I was more gonna say, do you see yourself connected? Uh huh. Oh man, the lag is super duper real right now. Okay, there we go. Um, it's this weird thing in this game mm -hmm. where uh, if you're if uh, go to third person, zoom all the way out. If you look at where the connector tool is, you can actually see where your dwarf is. Oh, wow, you can. Yeah, I don't know why. That looks like a glitch. Uh, that must be a shading glitch. No, I, I think it's more so you can, um... Well, I, I don't know. know what it is. Oh, it's it's a material issue where the, uh, where the, the uh, overlay beams, like, showing the connections, are, like, clipping through the dwarf and, like, rendering them really strangely. Yeah. I'm gonna put this thing in a lift, by the way. It's, uh. Yeah. It's time because, for it to die. It's cool as yeah. shit. Because, but. Basically, the way it works is that, like, the, the overlay, like, little connections, um, are part of, like, the UI layer. And then, like, your player is also probably, I guess, part of a different layer, and it's, like, kind of messing everything up. Huh. Huh. What's this? Well, you haven't found the go button yet, I'll tell you that much. Oh. What? Nope. There oh. you go. The paint job on it looks fucking stupid, but it looks like it works pretty well. I don't know. Goodbye, bird. <laughs> I can't stop it. Yes, you can. Oh! I believe wait. you wander. Come back for love. What? I, I, I've tilted myself forward. Alright. Huh. This is nonsense. Yes, it is. From my perspective, uh, you look like a weird little spider thing crawling across the sky. This it's game... really creepy. For starters, I'm still impressed that uh, a lot of these builds don't even use... Benching glitches? I know. Yeah. Donk. And lag. But no, dude, you should. I'm gonna go up in this thing, and you should watch me and see how creepy it is. Because it sure. looks like a weird, like, squirmy I house centipede. It's like crawling across the mountains. Can't figure out how to get mountains. out. There's actually uh, multiple seats. Oh, the second seat is just purely cosmetic, sort of. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here, give me a second. I'm gonna. There you go. 
Ah, thank you. All right, so hold things okay, down. Okay, let me let me put you in the middle of a clearing. There you go. Okay, okay. nine turns on everything. I honestly have no idea how the rest of this works. Your guess is as good as mine. Do I look creepy? Yeah, it looks weird. Because of the frame rate glitches, it's just like... Yeah, I know. Really gross looking. Yeah. Anyway, I'm not really steering this thing. It's just kind of... It's just kind of going. Yeah. All right, Probably understandable. Land this. Okay. What else do we have? I'm, I'm just looking at the uh, our other just options. Weird shit in the workshop. Yeah. Yeah. What, like the hover bike and the vulture. I'm really All interested right. in seeing like the cool cool workshop yep. things that Get show up. Here. Well, you were you weren't impressed with uh, with plain Savini. Plain Savenny was, uh, well, I'm not gonna say disappointing, or, or anything. I just don't know what a Savenny is, and after seeing a Plain Savenny, I still don't really know what a Savenny is. <laughs> yeah, I don't know either. Well, this is cool. Bird, where are Bye. you? Uh, I don't know where I am. I kind of crashed on a mountain far away. This is interesting. I'm gonna put down the thing and I'm gonna kill it. Yeah, there's a lot of cars here that actually work great. Mm -hmm. No I'm, suspension I'm glitch. To see how the like the vultures came out. Yeah, I'm curious about that too. Are Are you on top of the mountain? No, I uh, I don't know where I am. Okay. There's like a small mountain. I'm gonna go across to that and figure everything out. Okay, because I think I'm on the small mountain now. Like, uh, I kind of went for where you were. Did you delete okay. the, um... Did you delete the helicopter, by the way? Yeah, the helicopter's gone. Okay. So any sort of lag that you might be attributing to it, I can assure you, is misattributed. So, so Keith's been waiting for us, by the way. So we should probably I see, just go. I haven't seen him in, uh... I haven't seen him he in TeamSpeak. He well yeah he's in my chat just waiting around we're waiting for oh. him we've been waiting for him for about an hour and he's like it seems unprofessional show up and it's like Keith we're waiting for you for Factorio ah foam of the mouth we have serious communication problems the three of us it's okay yeah, yeah. that was neat I'll probably keep this car around for the time being okay uh let's try did you try the vulture yet. No, I haven't tried the Vulture. It's, um... Okay, it's not so good. It's at the top of the mountain, but it's the wrong mountain. So I'm just gonna try a different, like, random thing and try to find you. Oops, that was the camper again. Let's kill the camper and try again. Yeah, the Vulture, not good. <laughs> like, it's neat. This is just, like, not turn or something. It's, um... You know how I said a lot of these don't use the suspension glitch? I... This apparently... One... Like... Well, not only does it not use the suspension glitch, it doesn't use a whole lot of, like, good... Uh... It doesn't use a whole lot of... Well, it's, uh... It's the kind of hover vehicle that, like, constantly goes up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Oh yeah, um, I see. So it's, and it's it's like skipping across the ground. Yeah, and its suspension glitch is decidedly. Uh, its suspension glitch is decidedly well, not suspension glitch. Its its turning is definitely slow. Uh -huh. Wow. Huh. huh. Speeder bike's pretty neat though. There's I'm a gonna lot try of Harold the dragon. There's a lot of moving parts. Okay. Okay. Okay, so 
I have no idea where you are, bird. It's fine. I'm currently trying to build Harold the Dragon. Okay. So you said you're on a small Herald the Dragon mountain. And you should be able to find right, me. Uh, how close are you to the sun? I have no idea. I mean, you can kind of look it up. Can you can you see where the edge of the map is? <coughs> Excuse me. Well, uh, one way or another, I'm on the op. I'm not near the edge of the. I'm not why don't you save? Why don't you save Harold the Dragon for tomorrow? Because it is Factorio time. Okay, sounds good. <laughs>